Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to give delegated access on GoDaddy. So before we start, of course, the first thing that you would like to do is just go and open whatever browser you are going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go into this URL section, simply type godaddy.com and hit the enter button. Of course, that should take you into this page. And if you're facing any issues with the language, as I faced in my first time in this website, you'll have to scroll down until the bottom of it and make sure to change the country or region, which will take the or which will change the language with it. Of course, if you want even to change the currency, that will be possible. So now I will have to go back and log in into your account if you have one. And if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create one. Of course, you will be able to do both options as this top right corner option, you will find the option to create or even log in into your account. Once you did one of those two options, you'll find yourself on this screen, which is going to be your home screen or your main screen on the on GoDaddy website. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial, is we would like to give a delega delegated access. And of course, if you want to do that, we'll have to click at our name at the top right corner, then click at my products. So we go into our products page. Here we will find all the domains name that we have. Of course, for me, I have just one. I have just this one. Just, just look for this domain section and expand it if it's not expanded. And then go and look for the domain name that you would like to give delegated access into and click at this DNS option. Once you click on it, this will open the DNS management for you. And of course, if you want to give delegated access, make sure to click on the settings option and click at delegated access. Once you click on here, as you can see, if they ask you to sign in again, make sure to sign in for me. I'm signing in with Google. So let me do that. And of course, as you can see, account I can access. If I want to request access, I can click here. But we can, as we said, we would like to give access. So invite to access. Click on this. Of course, you will have to enter the name of the person that you would like to give access to and his or her email. Then, of course, you will have to choose the access level requested. You can give him access to, or give her access to products, domains and purchase or just products and domains or domains only. Choose whatever suits you, then click at invite and the delegated access will be given immediately. So that's actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.